If you're a cat person, of course, you already have that affection and deep love towards your feline pet. It's a given. In fact, you may even love your cat more than your human friends. But you have to admit that even if they say love should be unconditional, you're also dying to know whether your cat loves you back. Or even just a little bit, maybe? Hey guys, welcome to Furry Feline Facts, a perfect catalog of cat stats. In this video, we'll be answering the question that I know has been bothering you for quite a while now, and that is, does my cat love me too? That is why I bring to you the 10 signs that your cat really loves you. But first, if you're not already a follower of Furry Feline Facts, meow is the time to click the subscribe and notification bell. If you are, give yourself a round of a pause. Okay, enough kitten around, it's meow or never. You may not have noticed, but your cat has probably shown you a lot of times that it's very much affectionate towards you. They do this mostly through their body language because, of course, they don't talk human and we also don't talk cat. Sometimes it's really tricky to understand them, but trust me, if your cat gives you the privilege of any of these signs, well, you can feel lucky and very loved by them. Oh, and don't forget to return that love. <laughs> Number 1. Your cat purrs when it is with you. A cat's purr is one of its main languages. It's usually a sign that he or she is content and feeling a little comfier. That's why if your cat is having a sick day and it lets out a purr, that means it kind of feels good, so you can leave him or her on a nice rest. But most of the time, when your cat's got no fever or no queasy feelings, when it's just your normal playful furry buddy and it purrs while rubbing itself against you, that means your little baby is showing love to mommy or daddy. Either that or it just wants something from you. They can be sly sometimes, you know. <laughs> Number 2. Your cat curls its tail around your legs. Well, there are tails behind your cat's tail. How erect it is or on what direction it is pointed says a lot about your cat's mood. For example, when it's laid straight down, it means back off, I'm not in a good mood, human. And when it's curved beneath the body like he or she is trying to hide the paws, it's like saying, I'm feeling nervous and kind of shy, human. But when it's curled, and especially when it's curling around your legs, it means he or she is feeling confident and happy with you. The same is true when its tail is held high and upright or when it's curled at the top like a question mark. It means it's acting friendly and wants some petting or playtime, especially with you. <laughs> Number 3. Your cat shows you its tummy. If it does this often when you're near him or her, that means it has an unwavering trust in you. Most felines consider their belly as a vulnerable point, so they try to protect it when they sense danger or enemies. So, the fact that it lets its guard down and shows the tummy comfortably to you means that your furry friend knows it's safe with you. When this happens, you might be tempted to give him or her that never gets old belly rub, but I recommend you resist that urge because you might get some scratches or bites if you're not observant. If it's purring, then you can touch that tum tum, but if it's not, it's better to back off and leave that squishy belly alone. <laughs> Number 4. Your cat licks your hair and ears. <laughs> Cats are very choosy when it comes to their circle of friends. They don't even like much of their own kind sometimes. I guess we can say these felines got some attitude. So when your cat licks your hair and ears, congratulations. It means you likely just earned a VIP pass to their elite club if ever they got such a thing. We never know what these foxy creatures are hiding anyway. The licking means it's grooming you. That sounds like the tables have turned and you've just become the pet, but that's just actually how it is. For cats, it's some kind of affectionate grooming and they usually do this when you're also lying down or when you're asleep. Other times, it just wants to remove your human scent so you can smell more like them. That's a real thing. <laughs> Number 5. Your cat blinks at you slowly. This slow blinking, or sometimes called kitty kiss, is another way that your cat communicates how much it's fond of you. For cats, closing their eyes towards another is an ultimate display of trust, though this should not be confused with their normal blinking when they're usually just trying to remove dirt from their eyes. So if you really want to observe this fascinating body language, observe when your cat is in a chill mood because a kitty kiss only comes from a comfortable cat. 
Jackson Galaxy, a cat behaviorist and host of the TV show My Cat From Hell, says that to witness the kitty kiss, which he personally calls the cat I love you blink, look softly into your cat's eyes while thinking I, then close your eyes slowly while thinking love, and open your eyes slowly while thinking you. Then, fingers crossed, hope it blinks back. <laughs> Number 6. Your cat needs you with its paw. This is when your cat pushes you in and out with its front paws, alternating between its left and right. It is also sometimes called the making biscuits act, and it's one of the signs that your cat is comfy when you're around. It means he or she feels happy and finds contentment in you. Experts think that needing is one of the behaviors that cats have retained from their childhood when they used to need their mama's teat when they were being nursed. Some also say that needing is a cat's expression of owning a territory. So if your cat needs you, it means he or she loves you so much that he or she decided to keep you. Congratulations, you've just been adopted. <laughs> Number 7. Your cat follows you around. Well, if this isn't the most obvious sign that your cat likes you, then I don't know what is. Even for us humans, we tend to cling to the people we like. Cats are one of the most loving and affectionate creatures, and when they can't quit following you around, it means they're seeking attention. It's like your cat is saying, notice me, human. At times, they love doing this when they see that you're busy. That means they're very interested in what you're doing and perhaps they also want to be involved so they can spend more time with you. Yep, they can be extremely sweet. Well, except for the times when they're just hungry and the only reason they're following you around is because it's nearly feeding time. <laughs> Number 8. Your cat nibbles you most times. <laughs> Gentle nibbles from your cat are also called love bites. Yes, it's a sign of affection. According to cat experts, just like kneading, it's one of the behaviors that cats remember from their childhood when their mama would lick and nibble them for grooming. There is also this thing called allo-grooming, which is common among social animals and though cats are considered not that social, they also exhibit this grooming behavior. It's a way of increasing the social bond among the pack. So basically, it means your cat wants you to know that he or she is becoming fonder towards you. As long as you don't suffer from skin breakage and your cat nibbles you without hissing, growling, and clawing, that means he or she is just giving you some love bites. <laughs> Number 9. Your cat loves bringing you presents. <laughs> well, I didn't really mean presents as in fancy little boxes with the ribbon on top. Sometimes it's a ruined plastic toy it found from your neighbor's trash. And sometimes it's a mouse or a bird victimized in their mini hunts. It may be a rather weird and unpleasant way to gift someone, but in the feline world, this is like the highest form of respect for a cat's human. With this gesture, your cat is sharing with you the trophy of his or her hunt. Remember that cats came from the Felidae family, which includes cheetahs, tigers, and lions, so you really can't take out hunting from your cat. Besides, now that you know it's a language of affection, I think you'll look forward to their next present from now on. <laughs> Number 10. Your cat gives you headbutts. It is when your cat taps its head against you and rubs its cheeks along whichever part of you is near it. It may look like it's on a playful and petting mood, but headbutts are more than that. When your cat gives you the bumps, it wants you to know that he or she trusts you enough and there's no issue becoming personal with you. According to cat behaviorist Pam Johnson Bennett, who has authored eight best-selling books about cats, headbutting, or better called cat bunting, is usually used for bonding and other social purposes, and cats do this by spreading their scent. There are a lot of scent glands scattered over your cat's bodies, and aside from their more apparent purpose, scent glands are also used for scent communication. Most people believe that cats spread their scent to communicate their marked territory, but the truth is, they also use it to create familiarity and show respect. So the next time your cat gives you a headbutt, return the act to also show respect and trust. They'll appreciate that. I'm pretty sure your cat has shown you one or two or even more of the signs mentioned here. If not yet, then don't worry. Your cat just may have some trust issues, and don't we all? Give it time and your pet will overcome that. Maybe some treats can help. Well, there you have the 10 signs that your cat really loves you. If you were blessed by the sweet cat gestures, 
hit the like button and let us know in the comments how your kitty says I love you. And if you love your cat regardless of if he or she loves you back, make sure you subscribe to Furry Feline Facts, a perfect catalog of cat stats. See you next time.